Hey guys, I am going to show you how to do a bang braid. It's really easy. All you need is your hairbrush, one of these ponytail things, or two bobby pins. So your bangs can be as long or as short as necessary. Uh, mine are on the longer side right now to be considered bangs, but um, I've done the famous Jen V. Shaw's bang, uh, bang braids before, and her bangs are right at about the eyebrow length. So it's all about, you know, just what you feel like your skill level is. You ha you, it helps to know how to French braid, but you don't have to. I usually just do mine with my natural part, which is this way, but you know, sometimes I can flip it over, make it deeper, etc. So you just start with a section of hair, and I'm gonna get closer now, so you can see what I'm doing. You can see this. So I start with a small section right here in the front. See about that much hair, all things considered. And you turn it, divide it into three pieces like so. And then you start braiding. And the, my trick to make this braid easy is to pull from only the side hair from the side of my uh, by my face so I don't pull anywhere from here some people can but I just find that the point of this braid is to be really casual and when you pull from the other side it just kind of makes it you know it's just a lot harder and you want this to be quick and easy I mean this whole thing I, I whip these out in like nothing flat and uh, the cool thing about these braids is they don't have to be perfect. You know, they don't have to be, you know, an, a uniform amount of hair going in. If it starts to curve, it can definitely do that. You know, the whole point is just to get your hair off your face. It's a great summer style. So then you can, when you get down to about here, this is where you start having room for, you know, some interpretation. I usually will go a little bit further down, so I'll do that. But some people will go all the way down past their ear. You know, they'll braid like down to here or something. And it's all up to you. Personal preference for the win. Um, but I'm gonna stop here. And I just like to braid it out a little bit so I have a little bit more room to play with. Like that. And then you have a couple options. Uh, some people just tuck it under like that and pin it. I usually pull it like this. And this is where um, you can either make the decision if you want to braid it down and have it hang down, then you can use your handy dandy purple ponytail holder. But I like to use my bobby pins. So I take the bobby and I just sort of Put it one in like that, and then the trick to making bobby pins stick is to cross them like that, like an X, and then they anchor each other down, and you're done. See how easy that is? So now, you know how to do the perfect summer braid. Super easy, super cash, little effort. So go forth and braid, and be merry, and all of that.